let's take black people out of the equation. Mm-hmm. Let's take all races now. Yeah, yeah. Even when you walk into Little, you see older people working in the shops than students, mm-hmm. I think. Yeah, yeah, no, you're right. And I feel like there's a level of comfort. And I don't know if it's because the German social system is so good mm. that people don't really aspire to be, you know, to go further than yeah, that. Yeah, now, I think it's, it's definitely um, the, the, the social system, but I also think um, they're actually very comfortable. Mm. Like people that work in those places mm. um, are very comfortable because of like their pay mm. not being that bad. Mm. Like people yeah. that work in Lidl and Audi, they actually earn yeah. decent money. Mm. And um, yeah, so that's that's why like, I don't think like um, here students tend to do more. I wouldn't. I would say high street retail. You know mm. the H and M's, Zara's, and, Zara's and that kind of yeah, stuff. Okay, okay, okay. Um, and I think maybe that's also got something to do with um, them not being allowed to earn more than a certain amount a month, for example. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I think um, a lot of students get um, help from the government mm. to pay like to um, to pay for uni and that kind mm. of stuff, and um, they're only allowed to work. I think it used to be 450 and now it's 520 oh. um, euros a month. And um, Audi and all, all those places, I think they tend to look for people that can work more hours during the week. Oh. And um, yeah, so I think that's that's part of the problem. Ah, as well. okay. Just, that, that makes a lot of sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, you, you know, in England, you can, I think in a year, it's 10 grand before you get taxed. Before you get taxed, yeah. Yeah. 12. Is it 12 now? 12 grand. Yeah, it's 12 grand. Here is, um, it was 520 times 12. We were looking at around 6,000 mm. euros. Um, anything above that you, you get taxed mm. so there's not really a point so mm. yeah okay that makes sense then that because I always walk into these establishments and I'm like why is there like no younger people mm. working here you know? I think another thing as well obviously here you automatically pay into your pension um, mm. and um, in, in Germany as far as I'm aware if there are like gaps in your in your um, in your work experience like your pension reduces like drastically so I think once they get a job they hold on to that job because mm. they know the pension at the end is mm. going to be good as well so yeah there, there's there's different aspects why people tend mm. to stay in in, in those places mm. yeah yeah it's very interesting it's very interesting how um this is good mm. um that obviously people are able to have a full life mm. just working in retail because mm. you don't really find that in the uk mm. people struggle people who work in retail usually struggle to um, kind of get lot, especially in London where mm. it's so expensive so it's good that it's like that in Germany mm. it's just I just felt like maybe for me I feel like don't people aspire to like kind of get higher I, I, than I think that. it's the low cost of living as well exactly. it's the low cost exactly. of living I mean exactly. um, if you just look at simple things like rent for example mm. um, you can easily live by yourself in a what two yeah. bedroom flat here yeah. and pay I don't know 600 mm. 700 euros that's unheard of in england <laughs> unheard of you you i don't in england what, i know lawyers like junior lawyers mm. that have to share a home that's what i'm saying that's what i'm saying and that's that's crazy like even like doctors yeah what they earn when they come out of university yeah. is ridiculous mm. basically so how do you expect um someone to find a place there mm. for example so the cost of living here mm definitely makes people like um comfortable mm. and not doesn't it doesn't make them feel like they need to do more mm. like i'm good um i get to go on holiday three times mm. a year my children are all right there's food on the table so yeah so in a society where i would say that um climbing up the the ladder is not fully encouraged or is not i don't think it's um it's pushed enough yeah, I think that's the word pushed. Yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. pushed. People are not pushed to climb up the the career mm. ladder that much. How do you encourage, especially our people, to do that? Because if the people who have um who who potentially could have the privilege to be able to move higher up the ladder are mm. comfortable, mm. Um, why don't we? Why, we have every right to be comfortable too. Yeah, um, I don't know if I if I think about work for example, like where I work, there's you can tell people who are aspiring to be partners at the firm, mm. and me for example, I'm not one of those. Mm. I I do not want to become a partner, um, and I just feel like, um, 
it just depends on people's mentality themselves. I think in Germany they they really um push this thing of um, independence. You have to be by yourself. You have to find your way through life. And if that's not something that's in you, if that's not innate, then that's just not you, basically. So um, I think people just for themselves have to find out what they want for themselves. And then based on that, literally see where they can end up in. Um, so for us people, I think you just literally have to ask yourself, like, is do I want more for myself? Am I comfortable? If you want more for yourself, where do I go to next? Who do I speak to? Who do I approach? Who can teach me how to, you know, move move up in life? But um, I think it just comes down to the people. And I just, like we mentioned earlier, people are just super humble and just extremely comfortable here in Germany. Mm-hmm. So, um, yeah, you just, you just need to find someone that's extremely motivated to do mm-hmm. um, exploits, basically. Mm-hmm. Right? Yeah. Yeah, that's, it's, it's very interesting. I mean, the more I speak to people, the more I begin to understand certain things mm. and how things are. And um, I think you've shed a bit of light um, on some of the things that, like, I've had um, concerns about. It makes sense. The society is very different from how it is in the UK. Mm, yeah. 